What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today we are doing the Huge Giganticus Teleport Mechasaur deck. We're going to be ramping up using our uh, Cryo Brain. We're going to be controlling using Line Dancer Pogo Mug. And you're either going to win by teleporting in Mechasaur or teleporting in Gondola. Once you teleport in one of these cards, it's very important to teleport it in so it doesn't just get removed by Shamrocket. Uh, these will put so many cards in the field, be able to take over the game that way. Now, now, um, we're running two copies of Regifter, which is a cool idea. Uh, because after you teleport in the Mechasaur, it'll make a minion. Then you play Regifter, it'll spawn two minions uh, immediately. That's basically the premise of the deck. Of course, we're running the best combo in the game. My favorite combo we call this Ram Spacito. Turn two Crab Brain, turn three Pogo, turn four Mog. It's anyway a good way of controlling and ramping up, and you have to kind of get to seven or eight brains in order to teleport these in. Running a ton of teleports in this deck. Hope you guys enjoy. Let's get into the game. Uh, are we doing the gambling here? Are we going to have time for 10 games? Is the real question. Let's say we're playing with this really slow deck. We'll have time for 8 games. And we'll gamble some channel points here in the live stream. Twitch.tv forward slash from up. Um. And. We'll say in order. We, are we going to get at least... Six wins, so it's more than five wins, guys. You have ten minutes to vote. Six and two are better. Here we go. Pass. Give me up on two, line dancer on three. Pretty good. Which one of these do we go for? What is he planning on upgrading here is the real question. I think this is so weak to line dancing or pogo that we'll actually just take this out. I'm gonna play pogo now in four, I guess, and we'll decide if we really need to front this because it's so dangerous this turn. I'll front it with line dancing zombie. If not, I'll just wait for the pogo next turn. Anyway, good for this to be to the left, because block meter. Interesting. Uh huh. So, I'm actually going to go for this, and I'll tell you why. Because this only is a 4 4. The Pogo's body itself actually takes this out, which I might go for. I know it's a little sad with the mug. We'll see. If he only plays, well, we have the option. I can always just bounce this. If he plays one minion here, we can clear his field. Ugh. I think I'm gonna take this out. Kinda just messed up his whole thing. Bouncing Pod Father back into his hands is probably not a good idea. Okay, play. Is Gondola a good card? It's not great because you kind of have to teleport it in or else if you just play it dry, they just remove it or, you know, make a stronger play. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, the mix of Gravedigger matches up with the 4-4. Marvelous. I'll probably just mug here again. Mug environment looks really good. The mug also heals. It took four damage, and now it's five five again. Kind of ridiculous. If he does anything crazy here, I'll just freeze it. Like growing this a lot. Mug needs a nerf. Yeah, mug would be good if it was like. It would be great if it was a four four. Even like a three four it would still be decent. Of course, Popcap's never gonna nerf a legendary. That would be. That would be just terrible. <laughs> Such a high value play right now. Some mugs are on one and two. 
And we actually get the stronger guy in, in lane, the one that gets the buff from the environment. In the environment. Be lucky. Um, sorry, I turned off my Twitch alerts. What did you say? 500 bits from Mr. Postal Man. Downloaded Twitch to send love. It's hard finding other people to hear as players. So you're autistic is my cool. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate it. Um, I'll just spam Gondol, why not? It's just I have so many threats in the fields. The, the strike through minion plus any of these. Get it done, so it's nothing. Close to nothing. Still lethal. <laughs> Was Maga super rare originally? <laughs> uh oh. Whee! Oh! It's large and in charge. That's almost like the same as like a gravestone. The shrink gravestone glitch. It got big for a hot second there. So far, so good. Looks fine. HG power would make this handle a little pain. Um, I think this is better. So it doesn't leave the mushroom on the field. At least trans. The plant trick or treater, yeah, from Seedling. That was a cool glitch. That was probably the wackiest glitch that's ever happened in this game. I didn't mulligan for Ramp Spacito. My bad. What is this? Amphibious? I, I don't understand. I don't understand. It's amphibious um, uh, uh, berries. Shelf mushroom. Maybe this is just like the all fusion deck, guys. I don't know. Never keep Pogo Mug against Nightcap, maybe. You're probably right. Okay. Okay, it doesn't even make this like a mushroom. <laughs> Why didn't he put this in the water? That would have been the better play and put the shroom for two here. He'll have a 3 2 amphibious. Pretty good. Okay. Alright, this guy. This guy has such a huge brain. Oh, daddy, your brain's so big. I don't even want to bounce this, this thing's useless! <laughs> okay. I don't know what's going on with this guy. <laughs> huh? Huh? <laughs> I don't know. I don't get it. I think I'm keeping this in the water here. You can replay this bean if you want. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'll bounce you. See a bean. It just costs extra to replay, so why not? I'll take the damage, I guess. It's pretty good. I could have kept the pogo alive, but I'm just hitting him in the face is the way here. Strike through environment would be pretty strong here. It means you just win next turn. GG. GG. 
I think this is right. Is there any way for him to, like, buff this so much that these will each... He'll have to draw three cards. I mean, maybe it's... Well, no, if he draws three... Four plus six, now it's not even enough. He'll have to draw... For these to get to 14... I'll have to draw five cards, never mind. I changed my mind. Maybe I'll have Cool Bean, guys. Maybe he got Cool Bean from Cosmic Bean. Uh-oh. Guys, watch out. If I was him, I would have actually played... <laughs> Maybe he has a Cosmic Bean. Oh, oh, look at this. Look at this huge. 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 Sorry. Reincarnation Blockbuster, that would have been cool. That would have been pretty epic. That would have been some highlight reel. Material. Material. Highlight reel material. That's terrible, Fry. Am I from the future? I've been predicting things. What have I predicted? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. But yeah, I'm definitely from the future. From this time where the human brain has evolved a little bit, and now people, like, live <laughs> logically instead of just being a... Anyway, sorry about that. Oh boy. Oh boy! Rip people evict now. <sighs> These games aren't actually taking that long. I thought it would take longer. We haven't even played Mechasaur. I guess we spammed a Gonzalo once, but... Oh boy, it's Ramspacito time, guys. Don't even worry about it. He's gonna play Black IP. God. Dear God. Okay, I don't care. I'm doing this anyway. Maybe that's not the right play. Maybe your mom not the right one. I just get an extra brain for the rest of the game. I think it's worth it, guys. I'll go with these two next year. And it's nice to have the teleportation zombies late so you can teleport in your win conditions. La 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 la, see ya. No field for you! Another pogo. I'm gonna do the fake pogo. I've been predicting cards opponents have played. I think if you know, if you kind of know, like, what are the good cards that people usually run, it makes it a lot more likely. He actually ran this into... That's some Bolshevik right there. He actually ran this into, um, into Pogo, which is really weird. Into potential Pogo. I, if I was him, I definitely would have made a multiplayer. You play around Line Dancing Zombie and not the Pogo that you've already seen? It's just... Awkward. Awkward. So we'll just bounce the Tricarid tops that he plays and kill the Star Slur. Beat me up's a pretty good answer to Star Slur. It's half the cost and it makes him draw one kind of useless card. I guess if he plays said card the next turn, kind of like value. As y'all know, I'm not a really big fan of this card. <laughs> it's so overrated. Uh, the button glowing. I never pay attention to that. I don't feel like it either. Did he? Okay, he conjured this. Guys, he knows. He knows <laughs> Come on, man. Ugh. What the hell, really? God damn it, man. So that's the point, man. We need a Mechasaur or a Gondol or something right now. You know what we need. Uh, that's rough. That was a pretty damn good Starch Lord play, not gonna lie. Uh. See if we can get this to kill the 3-3 three, three here. Uh, 
Oh, I'm so stupid. I should have teleported that. Thank you, Kostya, for subscribing. I totally should have teleported that in. I don't know what I'm thinking, man. I'm not. 27 months. Uh huh. <laughs> so done, man. Honestly, we need one of our win condition cards this turn or we're done. We're not gonna make it. Even that one, Mechasaur would go a really long way here. Really long way. Gondol might work. I'm definitely teleporting this in. I guess we'll block the 5 4 with it. It's not great still. It's over, guys. We ain't winning this one, believe you me. In fact, he could just win. He's gonna roll a one here, too. Watch this. For the win. Whole of Florida just wins, just straight up. Straight up win. That also wins. God. <laughs> That was pretty harsh, not gonna lie. I think Starch Lord really screwed us up there. And that was all because he played that Starch Lord in 4 and we decided to go to Line Dancing Zombie for the fake. If I would have played Pogo on turn 5, uh, I probably would have won that game. <laughs> probably. And that Spirus, the 3 2 Spirus in the water, also ended up doing some damage. Yeesh. I don't know, man. I don't think we need this in the early game at all. There's Mecha, sir. It's Bedorni. <sighs> I have no proof he was sniping, guys. They'll probably play around like a... Interesting. Does this go on the ground? I think it goes here. He doesn't really have a way of dealing with things on the ground except for... something we can answer next turn. I think this is fine. We can always freeze too. Freeze to keep a 3 1 alive. Why not worth it? Kale. Uh, I think it's worth it now. We'll just mug him. I think I want the line dancing zombie to be dry. So use this to counter the line dancing zombie? No, you put some water. Just... Okay. Not great. It gets five bullseye. Ugh. We sometimes win here. We usually win. Do a California roll. That's what we call it now. Yes! Easy. Ba da da dum dum. 
And California just drifted out to the middle of the Pacific Ocean. And that's what happened. It's time, guys. Should I look for a mug? Is this good enough to play on turn one? I'm looking for a mug. God damn it. Aha! We have a turn one play anyhow. And we're gone. See you later. Whee! HG powers are broken. A hundred percent true. Is Twitch and YouTube your full-time job? Yep. the right play, but this at least trades. The real double one so far. I think trying to become a YouTuber is worth it these days. Defense for who? Not gonna lie. You have to have the the patience to be able to make content consistently and get better at it and even when you have no audience watching you know when i started i had no one watch my videos when i started and you have to just keep doing it and really enjoy the process not you know don't too much you know like dream oh about becoming a big youtuber you have to like enjoy doing it even if no one watches you that's a really important so but if you feel like you have the personality for it and you're going to be consistent and you stay self-motivated and you know, you don't want to have a boss. You don't need that structure, and you're able to just stay consistent. If you're into consistency, then yeah, go completely go for it. There's, there's always room for another good YouTuber. You have to go into it though, understanding it's a long shot. I guess I'm just trying to be re really realistic here. It's a, uh, it's not easy. I think I'm just spamming this. We actually block, so it's kind of cool. My face somehow comes up with an answer to this card. You already used a spring bean, and that would be really bad. At least we get one card off of this. Stomping on, cool. And I, I want to teleport, man. Where the heck did he get Briar Rose from, anyway? <sighs> Arr. The Stomping on's not that good, guys. It's really not. Uh, getting a teleport would be really good. So five, two, one. This just loses its stats, right? Yeet. Really? That's so annoying. That's so annoying.
I don't know, do we go for this? I guess we'll go for this. Really you play out the better. I don't really need the 2-3 this turn. Stomping on Mug is like teleport rod zombie, exactly. So we get the teleport. Yeah, we're gonna try to teleport gondola here. That's a really massive gondola too. The mug looks good, but I, I really do want to teleport Gondol. Okay. Um... Man, I don't even know what to do. This is still gonna do five. I, 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 this is such a huge risk, but eight and eight wins. I'm, call me nuts. Call me nuts, but I'm, I'm going for it. I'm going face here. This is always gonna move, no, no, it might move to the left. Uh, this is such a terrible play. <laughs> if it moves here, we're good, and if it moves here, we usually win. And we rolled a three. Oh god, okay, so now we have to, come on. Okay, so now we have to roll at least a two here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. 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 Um, another teleport. Yeah, uh, I think we mug here. I think we mug. Oh my gosh. It actually resets everything, but I don't really need all the damage anymore. We'll actually get another shot from Cosmic, so it's a chance of getting, like, Synchronized Swimmer or something like that. We usually win here, guys. Usually. Oh, dear God. Okay, we have Teleports in hand. We have one of those. Okay, so right now it's Teleport Cosmic. Environment. <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. Survey says. I think like Sports Star makes you win there. Okay, so it's teleport. Might as well go with Cosmic here. Because it trades and gives us an extra card and Tennis Champ. Useless. Uh is there anything in our deck that helps us here? Not at all. Not at all. Uh, so if we roll a three, we win the game. If we don't roll a three, we lose miserably. I mean, if we if we don't roll a three, you know what I'm saying? I said it backwards, but we we didn't roll. If we, I don't even know what I'm saying, guys. I don't even know why you watch me anyway. <laughs> we won. The point is, we won the game. We need to win two more to. Ruin everyone. I think most people voted yes, right? Let's see how many people did the prediction now. 83% people thought we would get at least 6 and 2. The biggest one was um, 50,000 points by T Bone Gaming. 270,000 points on the yes side, 57 on the no side. Anyway. Now we'll get rid of you. I'll get rid of you because you're useless against Solar Flare. You're also useless. I think I'm gonna look for some actual... Okay, that's better. Uh, Alright, let's see what happens here. Aha! Now we have a good curve. <laughs> Thank you, HG Power. Thank you for being broken. Whee! We don't have to get five wins. We need six wins out of eight. It's not too easy. What are you saying? La 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 la. Play uh play uh 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 Sunny or Shroom, please. Please. They'll never expect it, guys. La 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 Bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. 
goes. <laughs> what the hell is this? What the heck is going on here? Yeah, I'll put this here. We. Look at this environment. Look at this graph. Guys, look at this graph. It's amazing. Okay, I think this is how the two for one works. I'll just bounce whatever he puts on here. Then we'll continue to pogo his ass to the Ice Age. I like the free teleport in this deck. It means you can teleport Gondola on like six. What the heck is going on here? It's a ramp berry deck. Uh oh. Uh oh. I forgot to mention that no one likes you. <laughs> Bye. Why am I so mean? <laughs> he rolls a one. Look at this crap. <laughs> He's just gonna play Sergeant. Sorry, Sergeant Stockberry. Haha, <sighs> 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 Pogo Mug I don't have a mug though. We have Teleport Mechasaur on 7, Regifter on 8. This looks pretty good. I, I kind of need some cards in the meantime, though. I don't know, guys. In fact, if I Cryo Brain next turn, we can get it on turn 6. I like your style, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, stop playing berries. They're dumb. No one likes them. Stop playing Imitator. No. No, 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 Um, so if I get striked in environment, do I play here? I guess I do. If I get guy, do I play here? I guess I do. Whee! Yeet. Aha! This is a very good thing. It's pretty good, actually. I just needed something to, <laughs> to block this with. We got a pretty damn good one, not gonna lie. See, now he's gonna think we're good. We actually can, like, teleport this in and then use the teleport. If he can't kill this guy. Eh, he uses Berry Blast. You're gonna, re gonna regret that. Oh, no. Uh, I think we have to spend this now. <laughs> you guys. Should I just take this five damage like a man? <laughs> no, 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 it means Megasaur happens a turn later. Aha! I think I'll hold on to this. We clear his field, everything's fine. I, I can't take the 5 damage there, guys, it's too much. It's too much damage! So much damage. Uh, what's better here, Pogo or Mug? I don't know, man. I think Pogo's better. Can't be certain though. Mug was pretty good. Especially against Solar Flare. There's no way to mill him, guys. <laughs> He's at seven. There's no way to mill him. <laughs> the Pogo's better, guys. The Pogo's better. The Pogo answers everything. Is it gonna like Strawberry or something stupid? Okay, I've bounced the same imitator three times so far. Come on, man! Alright, now we're going for Teleport Mechasaur on turn 7. Mog is such a good play here, though. I am tempted. We have 8. I'm so tempted. Okay, I'll do this. I can actually environment first if I want to. I want 7 Bullseye. It's kind of good with the three damage here. Not gonna lie. We can mug next turn to I don't know. Oh dear God! It's fine. Oh no wait, that's bad. Do I have to teleport mug? This mexer doesn't even live. This does four. So it'll be four, six, eight, ten. 12 would mean if he low rolls, he could actually kill me here. I don't know, man. 
I don't know about this guy. It's it's it could be lethal for him though is the problem. Uh, I'm going to do the more boring play, which is actually way smarter here. <laughs> way smarter. Million times smarter. Don't be a scaredy kid. <laughs> I mean, we usually, we statistically, we should win there. It means he can't roll a three either. Ugh. I feel like this is actually too... Easily, easily removed, so I'm just gonna mug again. Well, I can mug next turn. If Pogo lives. Where is Pogo? Pogo... Uh, I don't know, man. The Berry Blast is just too strong. Alright, I'll mix him up again. It's now a Milda. <laughs> switch him around. So, it's just the two mugs switch places, right? I don't know, the fuck is here? What the heck is this? Oh my gosh, that's very blessed this in the face. Look at these ones! <laughs> so this happens. Oh, that's a really good freeze. I think the regifter is here. Right? No, oh, a mug is here. That's fine. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. We're milling ourselves. We have to bounce this. See ya. I wouldn't want him. Okay, you're dead. We didn't roll triple ones too bad. Okay. Eh, you missed. Uh, I could use a teleport right now just for some security. Another mug would be nice too. Okay, teleport. Okay, I'm just spamming Gondol. Screw it. We are at his mercy. A berry blast just wins, and we just fed him cards with a regifter too. I don't think we're gonna make it here, guys. There are so many things that go wrong. There are Elderberry wins. Shalftrum basically wins because he could just clear this lane. Strawberryin. Oh, <laughs> Strawberryin wins as long as he has another berry. Come on, man. Okay, we're done. <sighs> oh, well. Maybe I should have gone for it. He actually did. So he ended up rolling. So you know what? Considering how he ended up rolling on that berry blast that he did to our face, he actually would have killed us in lane two. So don't go telling me that I should have mecha sword in three there and that turn that we could have won because the way he actually rolled, he would have won the game. He actually got to... He got us down to three. Uh, maybe not, actually. Would it? I'm actually confused. Good guys, just ignore me. All right, guys, we can go, still go six and two with this deck. Ah. Uh. How many games are left? Two games. What's most fun leap deck? Conjure leap is fun. I don't know. Well, leap kings with knight was pretty cool. With a rust bull, I mean. I don't even know what I'm saying. Rampspacito. Give me Rampspacito. <sighs> oh, that was a big sigh. Sigh fry. Teleport is the play. Really? 
Imagine caring. This stream is somehow much more fun to watch when you're not betting. I just love watching. Everyone reacts. <laughs> just the spectators for it. <laughs> it's like watching people gamble in the casino. Their lives are just getting ruined every second. So it's entertainment. Great. <laughs> Plays this into Pogo. Good job. Great. Great play. He's just going to play it again next turn. This is way more esports. Let's go. We can actually gondle next turn with this teleportation zombie. Pretty cool. Pretty damn. Pretty damn cool. He just plays nothing. He didn't feel like spamming the B-Rex and wasting both of our time, so that's nice. We're kicking this guy's tuchus right now. I think we go for gondle. Oh, dear God. Dear God. You don't scare me. I have gravestones next turn. I don't care. I have two gravestones. I'm going face. I don't even care. Pete Moss. Think you're so good? You're not good at anything. This guy's down to two health. <laughs> I don't know. I'm definitely playing a gravestone here. Ooh, Pogo, that's pretty good. It's pretty damn good. It's pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. <laughs> Dead ghost, guys. Dead freaking ghost, man. Now what? You got a Grave Buster in there somewhere? Did he conjure one? Is there any way for Captain Combustible? There must be a way for him to conjure a Grave Buster. I don't know if there's a direct way, but he can at least conjure something that can conjure a Grave Buster. How do you get it, guys? Suddenly Southern Fry, I know, right? Pretty damn good, if you ask me. Does Gondola in the water always make an amphibious minion? I think so. I think so. Like, Bad Moon Rising doesn't, but Gondola does. And Plankwalker does. wonder what the difference is. Yee! I wonder why Bad Moon Rising doesn't always make an amphibious minion. It's kind of interesting. Got him. Alright, guys. Here's the deciding game. Here's where all the beans go. Let's go. And it's Bedorni again. Should I count this? <laughs> Fine, he plays meme sex. I don't mind getting sniped as long as it's for the memes. Alright. Ram Spacito, let's go. It's gonna be Cycle Cap there. I hope it's something stupid. I'll save the environment just in case. I'll save the environment just in case. That's what Greta Thunberg said. Got him. <laughs> That's not what she said. She said, how dare you? <laughs> I shouldn't make fun of Greta. Why am I doing that? What do you have to gain by making fun of her, Fry? There's no... <laughs> He just got he just got pomegranate from seedling. That's pretty damn good. I had enough of your insolence. Ah, uh, get wrecked. <laughs> Heresy. I know, right? Because everything she says is the gospel. Can I say I'm a heretic? Can I say? Who's Greta? She's this um, 
was this teenage like environmental activist from somewhere in Europe, I don't remember where. Netherlands or something? What the hell? What in what in tarnation is going on here? Sweden? Sweden. I don't have a problem with Greta Thunberg, by the way, just for the record. I, I have no no problem. Um, just want to make that clear. Oh, dear God. Oh, oh no. What am I supposed to do about that, man? Ugh. Okay, give me something that, like, kills us, please. Oh, uh oh. Do we look for the teleport here? We do. Ow. This is a reincarnation. This is not okay. Wah, 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 wah. So he's doing six? Could you not? Next door would have just won, actually. <laughs> Ain't that dandy. Okay, so he's still doing nine. <laughs> okay. Guys, it's time to reincarnate our moms. I don't really know what that means, but... Okay, cards. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you know what time it is, folks. You know what time... Okay, so we want one in the... Hmm, I guess this really doesn't matter. <laughs> Some top deck madness. Here we go. And we have teleport in hand, so it makes it good. Whee! We got Valk. Come on, man. Why? Why is Valk in the snow? Val Valk needs to Valk needs to not be a history zombie. You can't just make Mechasaur worse by making Valk in there. you got oh gosh, seedling lives now. This is the worst day of my life. Okay, it's fine. I'll just try. <laughs> These cards go on. Both seedlings actually live here. Welcome. Come on, Valk! Valkyrie! It doesn't even kill the seedling! It's not okay. It's not okay. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Valk, do something! It's basically Bob, except it's a Valk. Okay. Alright. I see how it is. Rawr. <laughs> okay, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> Not gonna lie. They're pretty damn good. Okay, so we're using this to chum block and we're just teleporting into Mechasaur again. Um, yeah. We're down to five health. I don't know about this game, guys. Oh, dear God. I don't know about this one. I don't even know about this one. I wonder if we teleport the Mechasaur here. Does two or three damage really matter here? Roar! Make one of these. Did we just miss Lethal? I don't think so. Aha! This doesn't activate. This doesn't activate. So it's seven, eight, nine. I think I might as well do this one. I can also do this to clear a lane. Laughs in very blast. No, 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 no. Okay, now we have an environment. That's cool. Ooh, Mechasaur could win now. If it gets lined up in the right line. 
my gosh, this is so tense. <laughs> uh, okay, that's good. Next are here for the win. For the win, guys. For the win. For the win. God damn it. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Uh, so the play is teleport. Oh, we have a, <laughs> a professional zombie on the field. Whee! And then we'll give him one of these. One of these. It's a doozy. Oh my gosh. He's actually drawing two cards. This is terrible, guys. This is not okay. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. At least the super doesn't do anything here. Okay. <laughs> he needs a bit. This is all about him getting the berry blast. We have enough teleports and stuff to get by. We need one damage. Rawr. We'll have. Oh no. <laughs> no, 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 no. We have all these cards. Rawr. <laughs> I'm untrickable. I wish I could put this here. <laughs> is I'm untrickable good here? I think it is. Guys, we gotta get the untrickable value in. Shut up. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. I don't know if I should count that as a winner or a loss. He actually had very blessed. I think we have to play one more game, guys. I don't think I should count that as either. This is the deciding game for the for the bets, guys. Oh, I don't. If I play one more game, it's probably gonna make everyone mad too. <laughs> everyone who voted no is saying it's a loss, and everyone who voting yes said it's a win. <laughs> Completely unbiased opinion, guys. Completely unbiased. Or maybe. Maybe optimists vote yes, and that's why they think it's a win. And pessimists vote no. So maybe it is consistent. I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs> maybe I should just cancel the whole bet. I don't think that'll make anyone happy. I think I'm going to not count that and play one more game, since the stack is being fun anyway. <laughs> I can't, I can't decide. I can't decide. This is a tough decision, guys. After very little deliberation, decided to just play another game and let's decide it that way. <laughs> Come on, I want Ramp's Pasita so badly. <laughs> Everyone's arguing so hard. I kind of like it. It's entertaining. There's, there's actually, like, something at stake with the bets. Maybe I should I should bet something too, guys. Stop the counting illegal matches. <laughs> nice. See, that's real political humor right there. Some biased Stephen Colbert crap. Doesn't matter who you are. That's that's a good joke. That's a good joke. Okay. I'm gonna cryo bring this guy right in the face. What the hell is he doing, man? I think we're gonna have to pogo this next turn. Wow. Wow, this is this is actually how we lose. Oh boy. <laughs> I think we have to do this, right? Pretty damn good. It's pretty damn good. Could I have a one drop, please? I think I'm going for it. Die, insect! Got him. <laughs> That's so great. Thank you, Haunted Pumpkin. I would say this might be the... Oh, when he doesn't get anything. Oh, and he's playing into Pogo! Thank you! He's playing right into Pogo. We can even go for the freeze here. Pogo's better. Or is it? What's better here, freeze or Pogo? Man, I don't know. Freeze develops a lot more damage on the field. I think I'm going for Freeze. I'm going to play around Blockbuster, too. We can always Pogo this next turn. This doesn't do anything. That's a big... 
the big one. But he did play in the pogo. Like, if he would have developed a health nut, let's say in lane one, and then had, a, like, another play that wasn't Elderberry the next turn, um, this would have been a pretty bad play. This was really kind of relying on the fact that he would go for an Elderberry setup. But anyway. La 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 la. So just bouncing now. Boomer Barry. <laughs> That's pretty good. Boomer Barry. Blockbuster sucks now. Not good. Terrible play. I mean, a lot, maybe if he has a one drop. But Harry basically used, he used most of his ones already for, I don't know, most. But. Is it turn six? No. D9, man. We're stable, really, for the rest of the game. This helps, too. Yeet. 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 <sighs> Teleport! This is a... This is a real decision, guys. If this explodes, this dies. Oh. <laughs> it's gotta be Mechasaur, right? It's gotta be Mechasaur. I mean, what if he puts five damage on our face? But if he plays, like, um, no, he can't play Poison Oak. He, we know he has an Elderberry in hand. You think Pogo's really the play? Pogo's definitely safer. Alright, I'll go Pogo. <laughs> it's going for Elderberry again. It's a kind of waste the little buddy. This is pretty good. He didn't actually exploit the three one dying, which is really nice. It's again, you know, if he get he had a, a couple plays, I think there, I think that would have been way better. Rules of one there. It's unfortunate. It's also hard to kill him because. Where's our teleports, man? There it is. Oh, we're going for it. <laughs> oh yeah, this is how we just break this game wide open. Whoa. Whoa, 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 He's running heal as a finisher in an aggro deck. That's I've never seen this before. Like you can even run a couple K. He's blocking our block. Dear God. Um. Whoa. Yeah, uh, kind of made it obvious, but he's not going to have anything to play here. We'll see how a second little buddy. Huh. Maybe that was too much information. Could be it was. BMI. Here we go. Really like the Mondo Bronto here. Oh, uh, no, we actually get two things. Ooh, okay. So we get a teleport. Give me Undying Pharaoh. Please. We got two teleports. Raw zombie! Okay, that helps actually. Uh does he still have an elderberry? No 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 no. No, he still has an elderberry. He still has an elderberry, we lose. Should I was that lethal last turn already? Because I I might have just thrown. He still has the elderberry. I think I just threw this game. I totally threw it. Was this lethal last turn? We needed to teleport in Pogo there instead of Mechasaur, right? No, we're done. Because it always makes two guys. In fact, playing this was terrible because we could have at least played Pogo. Wow. I don't know. You used to think one move ahead. I just didn't... What the heck is he doing? There's nothing that saves us here either, right? There's nothing in this deck that sa there's nothing in this deck that saves us. Too bad. No, we're done. We're done. 
God oh, damn, that elderberry ended up killing us. So the play wasn't even teleport Mechasaur. The play was you play for the heal and you teleport in Pogo, I suppose. Or you just don't. No, oh, it's still 50 50. Oh man. Alright, guys. We didn't get six wins. <laughs> I didn't get it, man. I'm just trying to think what the chances of even winning if we don't even play Mechasaur there. Oh, we need to pogo the strike through. Oh, strike through strong. Elderberry is a strong card, man. So it would be teleport pogo. Or just teleport anything. We only had the one teleport though in hand last turn, right? Yeah, that was we were in a real tough spot. So we went aggro and finished this off with freeze, with healing, kind of. And then just hit us with an elderberry. The elderberry has one time that game. Come on, man. <laughs> and everyone, everyone who voted yes is saying that we won the last game. <laughs> I'm pretty happy calling this a no, so I'm gonna choose the outcome and say we did not, we did not win the six games. Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. That was a really fun stream. I'll definitely go on YouTube though. Amazing. Peace. This is Fry.